time for Juan to come home. Danny. I attacked this archipelago with a man named Juan Cortes. He helped me build Libertad from the dirt. Juan's a spy master from the pre-Castillo days. Can build an ICBM from a goddamn ice cube tray. Pulled off ops for Espinosa, the KGB, then flipped to the CIA and Mossad for fun. Juan is my mentor. He's also unstable and an alcoholic. When shit went south, he was so embarrassed he walked straight out of my camp. Castillo soldados would love nothing more than to capture a double agent like Cortez. I need him back with Libertad, Danny. He's done with us, but you're a fresh face. Take this earpiece. Juan made them for comms, then head to the village. If I were you, I would check the bar first. Get down to that village and bring me Cortez. I hope for your sake he's sober. Danny, how's the earpiece? Can you hear me okay? Loud and clear. This spy shit works, Clara. I'll give you that. Bien. Keep your gun holstered if you want to stay out of trouble, especially in areas with a lot of soldados. Si, I got it. A smart guerrilla picks their battles. Suerte. That looks like a Juan. Today we drink in the worst fucking cantina in Yara. Or is it Colombia? Kirat, Chechnya. Leave the bottle. Let's work for you. Another. Guapo, you listen. Rule 16. A guerrero's revolution never ends. Always another war, another cantina, another ugly bartender. Juan Cortez. What you think gave it away, Wapo? This isn't a fucking zoo, abuelo. Clara sent me to find you. See, si. I learned long ago never to doubt her. You will too. Hey, I know you. Don't think so. Yeah, I know you. It's like I'm looking at a mirror, Wapo. What are you talking about? Those eyes, guerrilla. You got a taste. You convince yourself you're a hero, but you wake up a junkie, just like Juan Cortez. This is a fucking waste of time. Can you whistle? What? Nah, you can't whistle. more dead anyway.
the fuck? See, Guapo is in love with you. And I ruined the only copy of my book. Bueno, mis socios, vámonos. Once again, we have outstayed our welcome. fucking army shows up. I'm drunk, but I'm not that drunk. Right behind you, old man. Wapo wants to be your friend. Or maybe he just needs to take a dump. Only one way to find out. Come on, let's get the fuck out of here. I can tell you handled the gun before. What's your name? Danny. So Clara says you're a legend. Ex-KGB, ex-CIA. <laughs> I got more fucking exes than your porn search history. Some men, they break eggs for breakfast. But Juan Cortez, he breaks fucking countries. Hold up. New plan, Danny. Vamos. The plan is to go back to Clara's camp. Where the hell are we going now? See that smoke? That means the watchtower just got a supply drop with some of the rarest materials you'll find in Yara. And you are going to go get it. Now you want me to steal shit for you? Gunpowder and Supremo Bond. The Cerveza and Chaser of Resolver. I'm gonna teach you to make shit for weapons. Because making shit for weapons is cool. And it's rule number nine. Always use the right tool for the right job. Coming with me? Fuck no. You got guapo. You can tear shit up with him, but if you want to be sneaky, leave him behind. That cutie loves to make a mess. At least you're here to help me. Weapon or not, the military will shoot me on sight here. What are you going to do with this one? Guess this could be useful. Thank you. 
You are Yara's eyes and ears. This is more like it. Put that thing back in the water. Yara, estas son palabras sabias de nuestro valiente presidente. Every people has its time. Once it was the Greeks, then the Romans, the Franks, the English, the Angles. Put that thing back in the swamp where it belongs. Clara Garcia and Maria Terrestas are all that stand between us and our destiny. They are thieves whose goal is more shit for one. Found all your shit, Juan. Good work, Danny. Now hurry up already. We need to get back to Clara's camp. That's what I've been saying. Okay, we got more than enough. Let's get the fuck out of here. So what's with all of this junk? You building something? Patience, Danny. Rule number eight. A guerrilla knows how to wait. Like a spider or a serial killer. So, how did you get to this godforsaken hellhole? I was on a refugee ship. We didn't get far. Yeah, yeah. And I came here on a chopper in our baby invasion of Santuario. Shot straight out of the goddamn sky. No, I mean, what's your story? The orphanage in Esperanza. Then the military. I'm no guerrilla. Just helping Clara out until she gets me off this island. Rule 20. Once a guerrilla, always a guerrilla. Enough with that shit. Too late. The horse is out of the barn, and now the fucking cocaine is all over the kids, Danny. There is no other option. America is my option. <laughs> of course. And you think Americans want your Yaran blood? The American dream is for Americans, Danny. You don't quit, do you? Nope. Guapo hates quitters. Coño. If you two are so close, why is he following me? Guapo goes with those who need him most. Like those therapy dogs in your precious America. You can trust Guapo with your life. Yeah. Not sure I'm there yet. You got time. You said your chopper was shot down in the invasion. Can you fix it? So I can fly you to the Yankees? No, that's... It's grounded. But I'm working on it. Patience, Danny. Now it's time for Juan Cortez to show you how to make something out of nothing. Did I ever tell you rule number nine? You just did. Always use the right tool for the right job. Words to live by. Okay. How many others? The legend returns. The legend needs to piss, Hefa. Who's she? She was a journalist who dared call Anton Fascista. Now she's an outcast, a slave for his paradise. And she's not the only one, Danny. Time you learn about Resolver, Danny. When I was six, I rigged my first bike with a chainsaw motor. The blockade means I have to Resolver every day, Juan. Nah, that's survival. For a guerrilla, Resolver isn't just making do with what you have. It's inflicting chaos with everything you've got. Keep talking. A 
A guerrilla's best weapon is the workbench. Go ahead, Danny. Let's take a crack at those weapons. No offense, but your battle rifle is a little basic. Let's fix that. Rule number nine. Always use the right tool for the right job. In this case, it's gunpowder and scraps. Sometimes I lie awake at night asking myself, Juan, how can you kill people faster? The answer is soft target rounds. Excellent, Danny. Now you can pop enemy flesh like a ripe watermelon. Okay, let's look at your other rifle. Let's say your target remembered to wear their helmet and vest today. You're gonna need some armor piercing. These round. rounds fly straight and true and go through Kevlar like shit through a goose. Nice! Now you got your own supply of high velocity war crimes. Let's look at your attachments. Time to make your very first suppressor. This will turn a bang into a bang at the cost of some range. See how easy that was? Now you can silently headshot your enemies like a real asshole. The workbench is your friend, Danny. A friend with benefits. Get cozy with it. Damn, making shit is addictive. With that workbench, you can build a new Yara. Danny, want to steal something excessively dangerous? You better be willing to die for a Hola, guerrilla. Stay strong. You really think we get through that blockade? A lot of us. Yeah, but me? What do I look like a fucking together, please? Good. You're here. Julio's not going to like this. I don't need to tell you that Viviro is the lifeblood of Castillo's regime. He's built work camps to produce it all over Yara. These plantations use outcasts as slaves to grow the tobacco plants they turn into Viviro. These are our people, Danny. Beaten, tortured, sprayed by poison chemicals. There's a camp on this island. We tried to destroy it when we invaded. We failed. Now we're going to finish the job. Julio is waiting for you at a nearby barn. Hit that slave camp hard. Suerte. Supremo. Now, if things get too heavy with the soldados, just pull the trigger. But one tiny, tiny thing you should know. Uh-huh. The Supremos are in an experimental phase. They need time to breathe after you use them. You know, so they don't overload and kill you. Could have told me before I strap one to my back. Just let that Supremo feed off the blood of your enemies. What? <laughs> You'll get it, Danny. <laughs> You'll get it.
You got this. Movimiento de libertad. Oh, bella ciao, bella ciao, bella ciao, ciao, ciao. Listen, I'm not going to bullshit you. I wanted to do this alone, but Clara gave me an order. I can handle myself. Don't give a shit. So could Lita. She should be here right now, but instead I get you. And I'm supposed to be in Miami. But instead my two best friends are dead, and I'm stuck here with you. So, truce? Enough talk. Step one, we hit the tobacco. Step two, we destroy their poison supply. Step three, we get the fuck out of there and Castillo gets a nice pretty message from Libertad. Got it. Take this gear. It'll protect you from fire and more importantly, Castillo's fucking poison. gear in the right situation will keep you alive. Yeah, the right tool for the right job. Been hearing that a lot lately. Listen, Julio. Lita was like a sister to me. She shouldn't have been on that fucking boat. She died because of you, perhaps. No. Anton Castillo killed Lita. If I could change anything, it would be me dying on that beach. Lita was a better person than I could ever be. And if she loved you, well... That just says a lot about who you are. Enough. Look, if you and I are going to do this, you need to know about the poison. You mean that shit they spray on the leaves? Its real name is PG-240, but we call it the poison because it fucks up your system. Try not to breathe it or get it on your skin. It can make you go fucking crazy or sick, like deep down sick. And if that doesn't get you, the cancer that grows inside you will. Coño. So you're a military. Marksman? Close us off? What's your thing? I'm good with guns. We get along. We'll start thinking. That gear I gave you is good for fire and poison, but guerrillas need gear that fits their style, no matter the situation, or they get themselves killed. This is a good place to scout it. Right behind you. Let's see what we're up against. Up here, Dali. See the Viviro tobacco and the yellow poison tanks? See. Si. Punch holes in the tanks to let the poison out into the air. Fun fact. Poison and fire make a hell of a mix. Big boom. Same idea with the fumigators. They're hard to kill, but they can't take the heat. You've got a flamethrower. You've got that Supremo. Time to fuck up all this Viviro bullshit. You know... Lita and I had a ritual. Psych us up before battle. A song. Hit me. El movimiento de libertad. Oh, bella ciao, bella ciao. Bella ciao, ciao, ciao. <laughs> For Lita. For Lita. Let's make some chaos, Danny.
burn this fucking place to the ground. Supremo is fucking perfect. See, and don't forget, if she needs a recharge, the Supremo loves it when you kill more soldados. She's fun like that. Repinga. Never.
sentado, encadenado. Oh, vela, chao, vela, chao. Burning sheet with a flamethrower? Felt familiar. I don't want to say I told you so, but... Look, we should move. That was a hell of a light show, and they're going to see the smoke. We work well together. See? Si. Listen, if you are good with Lita, you're good with me. Gracias, Danny. Meet you back at camp. 